Hello there, brothers. Assalamu alaikum to everyone. How's things? You good? Yep, we've got somebody on now. Hello, hello. Assalamu alaikum, Hadi. How you doing? I need to see a like, man, to say you're alright. While we're waiting, just give you a little show. I'll come here, mashallah, to see uh, Brother Ibrahim. Yeah? Nice little barber shop. Let me just show you from outside. Anyway, uh, alaikum, mashallah, we now have uh, seven viewers here, eight in fact, yeah, um, sorry, I'll just come to have a haircut here, um, I think it's looking good, mashallah, Ibrahim, mashallah is a good um, barber, but anyway, brothers, just a quick video, we have a demo on Monday, it's at uh, Parliament Square, Westminster, same time, four o'clock, so we need every driver to come and join us, yeah, thank you, Hadi. Yeah, Hardy man, I recommend come here. What's the address, brother? It's 84 Mile Grove, uh, N17QJ. Yeah, just Mash behind the uh, Shoulders Police Station. Mashallah, Ibrahim is the guy that come. Uh, he's one of our members. He was at the um, last demo. He's the guy with the speaker, and he's gonna be there again on Parliament Square. Um, so this is it. It's important that drivers turn up to this uh, demo. So we're into week seven now. So the pressure is on the mayor TFL, but it's also on us guys as well, yeah? So it's like I said, on uh, Monday, we got the taxis, the black taxis are also doing a demo. Summer. Their demo finish at four o'clock, so they drive out and we drive in. So it's gonna be packed out with taxis and then we move in. So, you know, like we got a big massive challenge. One, we need to send a message to uh, the mayor and TFL. We're at parliament. We got MPs, politicians watching us, and you know, like we need to show a massive force there. We need to show that we are united. You know, like I said in the past, I know like some people may not like me. They not may not like James or Charlie or Yasa or UPHD. But this is about us being a private hire drivers. This is about us standing up for ourselves, and it's important that we come together. It's important you're there. Charlie, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Charlie, man. I recommend you come and see uh, uh, Ibrahim. He's not too far from uh, the union's office. So, yeah, it's amazing, yeah? But anyway, going back onto the... Topic. Yeah, going back onto the demo issue. You know, like, we got a taxi there. They're going to be in full numbers. So we need to dare, be there with full numbers, yeah? I know we're into week seven. And I know the message out there, drivers are thinking what's happening, but we can't think like that. It's very important to understand something. It's like when you're ill, you go and see a doctor. You know, like, so if you're not feeling well, you're sick, you go and see a doctor. You don't turn around and say you're going to see a doctor when you're well, because it's pointless. So right now we're in a similar situation. You know, like we're being discriminated by TFL. We're being discriminated by the mayor. And it's up to us, we as an individual, each and every one needs to fight. We're all private hire drivers, this affects each and every one. Maybe it may not affect you because you work on, you will never work in congestion zone, or maybe you're leaving the trade, but you need to show that solidarity. You need to come out and show that support because the taxi guy is gonna be there, but we're bigger than them and we're much stronger and we need to show that message, yeah? So listen, everyone watching this video, First of all, please share this on all the groups that you're on. And, and the message to everyone on those groups, please come and support us. You know, like, I wish, I wish I could tell you what's happening, but we're into week seven. So the last seven weeks, we've been fighting, we've been campaigning hard. I know Charlie been doing a lot of stuff. And, and there's certain stuff that I can't tell you, like, what we're doing, because, you know, like... Um, 
Sorry about that. Um, yeah, so like I said, there are things happening at the back in the background. I wish I could tell you more, but you know, like there's exciting stuff. Like uh, we got some exciting news on Monday, which we'll tell you uh, guys once we're there. We're also excited that we're moving into this new location. It's something big. We're escalating it. We're gonna be right at Parliament. We're gonna move in straight after the taxis. Yeah, that's something that never happened. But we're gonna be there, and we're gonna be there in bigger numbers. Yeah. Secondly, you know, like um, Charlie also, he's, uh, we're going to be right into politics. There's a lot of stuff happening. I just don't want to talk about it right now until it actually happens. Um, but I wish I could. I wish I could tell you that there's something happening, but it's hard. I know people out there watching this probably thinking we, we wasted seven weeks. In fact, we haven't. And as, as an example, third week when we were outside uh, Blackfriars Road, um, when, um, on, on our third protest, yeah? The mayor issued a press release, and, and, and again, I think I think that was a good message to us guys. Even though the mayor turned around and sort of accused us and made us look misled the public in terms of saying that we don't care about the congestion, but just to get a press release from him is enough to say he's worried. And then as we're moving on, like for example, last week we had a lot of pressure from the police, and this this week alone, just to have this uh, protest on uh, Monday, I mean. Uh, we've got to give credit to uh, Jane Farrah, Charlie and all the guys behind the scene that made it happen, that made made sure that this demo goes ahead. But we had a lot of obstacles in the way. Uh, we had pressure from TFL, we got pressure from the police. But they're being pressured by the mayor and by TFL. But that shows they're worried. If they were not worried, they wouldn't. So clearly there is something happening. And there's a lot of stuff happening in the background. Like I said, I can't mention it. But guys, seriously, please, yeah? Let's put our difference aside, help us spread this message, get it out to each and every driver, make sure you're there. It's just two hours, yeah? Try and be there early, try and be there at half three. We're gonna be around um, Parliament Square, but like I said, more updates will be posted on this group. So please, guys, just come, yeah? But um, let me just see if there's anyone else around here. But anyway, brother, Asalaamu Alaikum. Yeah, so if you're watching this video in a group, please come and support us. This is your trade. It's not just about me or uh, the driver. This is for everyone. And inshallah, I reckon we can turn it. We need numbers. We've got to just keep that momentum going. We've got to be able to, um, we've got to have the willpower and the ability to be there and fight this every week, brother. Yeah. But anyway, Ibrahim, you want to say anything? No, I just want to um, see everybody there, spread the word, uh, tell a friend to tell a friend, be there. As you can see, everyone, they're running their own thing now, you know what I mean? But we still don't want to leave the fight. We still want to fight with each other, um, you know, be there for everyone else that's left behind, you know what I mean? So we're all volunteers. There's no money involved. Don't think that the um, few people I've seen back in the old year, I wonder how much they're getting paid for this, 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 that. Um, you see what I mean? So there's no money involved in this. It's all volunteer. Even him, I spoke to him. Um, you know, he's, he's doing his own thing, but we just want everyone, everybody to be there for the fight, to show everybody else that we're not minors. We are, we are, we are human beings because, as you probably know, especially Uber, um, I've, I've, I've just started my business like a mini cabin trade with Uber. I haven't worked before. But from the day one and from now, uh, Uber has brought um, uh, private hire drivers down the hill because they treat, they, the customers treat us rubbish. They they treat us very bad. That's enough. Like anyway, you know what I mean. So and now we're getting mugged off from with TFL with uh, you know with Uber at the same time. So my point is, long story short, uh, be there. I will be there. Hopefully, I'm going to get there early this time because of my guy was off that day. Um, but yeah, is that? Um, please come early with your music. Inshallah, but I'm going to be there early. I'll probably be there three o'clock. I'll park local. I'll be local. I'll set it up, um, and then just just as soon as they, the 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 black cows move out, then we can move in. 
Um, but where did, did they just stop anywhere? Or no, no, how it's, it's how just around the parliament. Yeah? So basically so you come the in parliament. around the parliament. We'll have marshals. And by the way, if uh, anyone out there watching this video, if you want to help us with marshals, just send us a message uh, or reach out to any one of us. Uh, we need as many of you guys out there to help us, support us. But one important thing, because we're under a lot of pressure by police, like last week they issued uh, a uh, section 12 against uh, James and they threatened to arrest him. <laughs> We don't harass no drivers, stay, stay professional, come down, we're going to demonstrate. All we're doing is parking our cars around the Parliament Square uh, and, and hopefully later on we'll just stand in the square. Uh, we could have a little rally there. Okay brothers, so uh, lastly just a reminder, this is about self-respect. It's about how much you have, how much respect you have about yourself because TFL has no respect for you, nor does the Mayor. You need to stand up for yourself. You got to turn around and say, "Look, I have respect. I want to fight for respect. All I'm fighting for is a bit of respect. We're not asking TFL to give us any like benefits. Yeah. All we want them to do is uh, not punish us. And that's what's happening right now. They are punching us, and they're discriminating against us versus black taxis. So we need to be there. We need to stand up for ourselves. So thank you, brothers. I'm gonna um, end it here. But just before that, let me just check any messages. Yeah. Anyway, Charlie, catch you later. And Asalaamu As Alaikum to everyone watching this video. Uh, once again, thank you for your support for the last seven, weeks, six weeks, in fact. Yeah. Uh, and but we got to keep this campaign going. Asalaamu As Alaikum, brothers. I love this. Yeah. Thank you, everyone.